35 on a pen. Yeah, I'm fly. You break no, I'm that guy. Oh, you break baby. no, I'm in the sky. Boom. <laughs> Boom. <laughs> hey, bring it back. Yeah, make sure you're watching. Cause when I'm dead, yeah, yeah, we're vlogging. Oh, oh, oh. Oh, oh, oh. You lot are probably confused thinking how on earth did we get here? Well it's the end of an era. Week one, let's go. section but yeah my meeting for 2 p.m has been cancelled so i'm gonna go on my run after my lunch so yeah i saw 14 15 for a can open i said ain't no way but there's one for 4 50 so praise god i got some granola because aldi stopped stocking the granola that i usually have um, if you guys have me on tiktok you'll know that granola hits good 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 so I'm back home now. I just need to have my lunch and I realise I actually have a lot of content I need to edit. So that's what I'm going to do. And then I'll talk to you guys when I have my lunch. That's all. Well, green apples are top tier, by the way. And I'm having my sun bites. But they're cool waves. Get to it. Thank you. And guys, I'm so happy. I've been looking for this data since like Monday last week. So it's been a week. And so I've just been stuck on 2.5k and I need to get to 3k. But um, we found it now, so yeah. Anyways, let me eat my lunch. I'm gonna continue writing, and then I'm gonna go for my run, and then I'm gonna come back and continue my work. So I'll talk to you guys later, bye. Maybe see you tomorrow, I'm not too sure. You see the granola I just bought? Don't ever buy it. This is the worst granola I've ever had in my life. Hey, it's so bad. Guys, it's so bad. Like, this isn't even like, I can't even act like this is nice. I hate spending money on bad things like and i'm really stalling because guys it's freezing outside like i usually just run in this but i'm gonna get hot okay if you stop complaining just eat and go just eat and go that's what you have to do should i even put my shoes on yeah because guys if i don't put my shoes on i won't go just did my first 10 minutes of running um wasn't too bad but my pace was quite slow anyways because i don't want to um, pass out on the road so yeah I realised I hadn't vlogged uh, for YouTube me running so yeah man guys I'm in my last five minutes um, yeah let's go I'm having my dinner as you can see it's hot this pasta is so good so we've got some minced meat some spinach um, what's this pasta called the m &S one, I showed you guys anyways, you guys know what it is, but it's really good. I really like pasta with spinach because I'm trying to get my iron up. Uh, I think I was shy when I just served myself that pasta because um, I'm hungry again. So I need to stop being shy and actually, you know, eat. Guys, I was actually just talking to my friend and I was just talking about, <laughs> it's so funny. I was talking to my friend Thomason earlier and he was just saying, if I actually forgot you did YouTube, what do you mean you forgot? I do YouTube. Um, and that's just how you know my inconsistency is just bad. Like, it's bad. Uh, and I know I need to do better. Um, and I'm trying, basically. But, and then, ugh, English. Hey, I need more English. God, give me more English. I'm going to do a sit down sometime this week because I genuinely feel like I'm not alone in this. And I also just want to share so you guys can understand why I'm not consistent. Because there are so many people that have said to me, Faith, like you can do really well with your content. Like you can proper grow this platform. I'm just like, yeah, I know, I know, I know. Some people just think I'm lazy. Some people think this girl's on serious. And sometimes I am lazy. Sometimes I am on serious. But there's another factor that like I think I've been struggling with for the past few years since i started i started youtube when i was 17. i put a few snippets of the thumbnails of what i look like when i started and what i look like now not even just what i looked like but even just the kind of content i was putting out i was sitting in one position doing my small youtube and that was it and i think for the longest time so i'm 21 now so that's about four years i've been like almost tugging 
with the idea that I am no longer that girl. Not in a bad way, like I've just grown. And that's normal if you don't grow, I'm a bit concerned. But yeah, like I've just grown. And I think if you guys know, like those that know me, if I say this to people that have only met me recently, they actually just think I'm chatting. Like I'm just, you know, this girl's just trying to say this to seem mysterious. But genuinely, it's not that I'm shy, but I am genuinely just a very reserved person. And I don't intend to be inconsistent. This is just very out of my comfort zone. I definitely think I've grown. I'm not shy anymore, but I am still reserved. And I think that's just my personality. And I genuinely just think that's just how I am. And I don't always want to share everything. So, yeah, I'm just learning to find balance. And I think that's it. Learning to find balance. I just have to be confident in my yes to God and do it well do you know what i mean like when i say yes like say yes properly don't say yeah and then you post one month and you post in the next four months that's that's not excellence come on do you know what i mean so i think that's just something i'm learning but if you said yes so do it properly kind of thing and if god told you yes i mean if 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 you said yes to god if god told you to do something he's going to give you the ideas like he's going to give me what to post like the more i've been consistent with posting on instagram and tiktok he's given me the ideas for like the series that i want to do so faith if you are only just consistent with youtube like he would give you ideas of what to post the kind of video ideas and things like that so yeah i think i'm just in the process of trusting god um and like being okay with the fact that my life is not my own and if god wants me to post you know more of my day-to-day -day lifestyle things i have to be okay with that because that's what he wants from me. Um, so yeah, bye. I'm going to meet in at Rooftop Gardens with Tara for a bunch of the girls. We're going to see if everything is right, if everything is correct. We're going to take videos as well. So yeah, I'm late right now, which is really bad, but it is well. Oh, is this the vlog? Hi guys, where are we? Rooftop Gardens. Rooftop, we have a meeting. Very professional, very good. Yeah. So yeah. exciting, bunch of the girls. Be there, be square. Very much so. Guys, this is the space for a bunch of the girls. It's honestly amazing. I'm so proud of her. Look at her. She's doing so well. Like, so well. So, yeah, we've obviously spoken with people. Um, the managers, right? They're event managers. They're event managers. And they've just let us come and film some content. So, I filmed, like, the Vogue style questions with her. You'll see on a bunch of the girls' page very soon. Um, so, yeah, like, it's going so well. It's going. And the drink, the drink i love a good sour sweet something it's, tangy, it's tangy. amazing so good <laughs> you know okay, oh yes hetty my laptop guys i had a had a mare with hetty okay but she's back she's back and kicking you know i'm so happy to serve her in this way like i love being here i love serving my friends i love sisterhood brunch of the girls i am the bee in the branch do you understand so yeah i wish i could show you the mocktail Hey, good. <laughs> I'm going to finish this drink. So, it's so nice. It's so yummy, guys. It's so yummy. Guys, isn't the venue just lush? It's like so nice. This is genuine favor. When you look at Tara, I hope you just see favor. Don't see Tara. Don't see Thelma. Just see favor. Because that's what this is. Like, Wait, like you think they made the venue for us? Bro. I couldn't have designed a more beautiful venue for this event. This is truly good. Like, cocktail bar. Perfect. Everything. Oh. What do you mean I have 23 days left until the end of this degree? I don't want to scream. I don't want to cry because we don't do that on camera. But, guys, I have to get a first, like, 100%. <laughs> I have to get 100% in that exam, like, I mean, in that essay. God is going to work it out. Like, I'm not even stressed. That's the thing. Like, I'm not going to come at like, oh, I'm losing my mind kind of thing. I'm not. I'm I'm so together. Like, I've got it together. It's Wednesday. The time is going by so quickly that I just keep thinking, like, it's basically Sunday. It's actually Wednesday. I'm actually exhausted and it's 1 p.m. I have a meeting at 2. And then I need to go to John Lewis at 3.30. And then come back here to pack things with Tara for a bunch of the girls next week um yeah guys there's a lot of moving parts plenty moving parts in life right now <laughs> listen this whole documenting the last few weeks of uni is going to be very interesting looking back because boy i know i'm going to be looking back like wow you know faith you really worked 
um and it's not even just the uni stuff yes like uni there's a lot of work to do um which i'm gonna try to do i'm gonna try like, like 250 words in the next 45 minutes i think i can do it a lot of work to do and then you know when there's just like small different things that come up and it's just a bit irritating yeah, i wanted to get it done for brunch with the girls and i've also just been wearing my natural hair out for a while and i'm kind of getting a bit tired of like styling it not that i don't like it or anything before you know the natural hair police you know come for me it's not that i don't like it but i kind of just needed a bit of a break especially because it's exam season um but that's okay i'll figure it out and i'm also just wearing this because i just as i said i can't be bothered to do my hair right now like it's not that i don't like it it's not i i'm just tired <laughs> I'm genuinely just tired. Um, so, yeah. I'm trying my best. That's all I can... I'm trying my best. That's all I can give you. <laughs> oh, gosh. Hopefully, when I see tired today, it'll, make, it'll cheer me up or something. Maybe I should call my brother. He makes me happy sometimes. I don't know. Maybe I'll call my mom. I don't know who I'll call. Let me just do this work. Okay, guys. I'll talk to you later. <laughs> Bye. <laughs> So we're packing the goodie bags for brunch with the girls. Why is it doing that? Yep. Some cool items. Fun and fresh. What is it? Mm -hmm. Let's go. Let me see what they're. Okay, I see. Okay, so what do you want me to say? Uh, you're the one that. <laughs> All right. So guys, brunch with the girls is next week, and we are literally doing the behind the scenes of packing all the goodie bags. I wanted to share with the lovely ladies what they will be receiving from us, but this is exclusive to the people who watch Faith Frozen's vlog. Very much and so. Yeah, so make sure you subscribe and you follow her on TikTok, or I will be withholding your goodie bag. Thank you. <laughs> so the first item we have. It's this lovely number. Lovely. So what we have here is a sample of this lovely brand that has offered us some moisturizer and skin repair cream. Lovely to try, see if it's your type of product. To see what that feels. And then we've got the ladies some samples deal. Oh, okay. So we've got a lovely sample of this amazing serum yeah. from Dior. And then the classic, iconic Dior Frouche huh? red lipstick to Very give good. it a go. So good. Bare Minerals Primer for you to sample. Um, and if you like it, you can get yourself a full bottle. I highly recommend. Sample of one of Faith's favourite, actually. Very much so. If you want to mm. get this for me, comment down below. Thank okay. you. <laughs> Um, a fabulous fragrance and we've got a variety of fragrances that the ladies will be receiving next weekend and finally an amazing product if i do say so myself amazing called super dots wow um, that helps with any acne or any spots that you have on your face and it really does do the job so yes ladies this this and so much more is what you can expect from next weekend so fun thank you Hi guys. Um I'm at the what's it called? Is it worship night? Night of, yeah. night of prayer and worship, Saint to Save and hey. RY. This is Annabelle's, my good hey. sis. They're currently setting up I'm a bit early. Um but yeah, this is so fun and fresh. I love this for them. You know, waiting on Annie to come. I don't know where she is. Um, so Annie, if you see this, drop, drop, thank you. Um, guys, my edges are finished. My gel is done. Like, I've been scraping. So tomorrow, I don't know what I'm going to do. I ordered more this. Hopefully, it'll come in time. Um, but yeah, it's Thursday today, by the way. I haven't actually updated you guys, but uni work is really uni and, you know. David, if you come and do your nonsense. Thank you. today because i'm traveling home and then um, i just can't be asked right now do you know what i mean i was on the phone to my friend um shalom yesterday and he was like some people on the road might mistaken you for a hijabi and i'm sorry but that's just not me but i'm wearing a headwrap kind of thing and even someone at church um 
when did they ask me someone at church must have asked me like oh is it like religious reasons like are you doing it because of conviction no guys this is i just i just don't want to do my hair right now also we figured it out um myself and annie are going to do my hair monday and tuesday guys pray for us i'll vlog it for next week's vlog in it but <laughs> listen i believe in us because annie's been doing her hair for time and i actually want to learn from her because like she's good like she's you know um proper experience in this so she's really going to help me with the part in and then yeah we're gonna go step by step i might even do a tiktok i have to do a tiktok come on like this is my first time actually no this is my second time doing my hair like by myself and i'll have a person to help me so yeah that's all uh i'll probably see you guys in london um it's really mcdowell today i don't know how i thought i haven't really processed i'm just excited to be there like it's not really like a celebrity um like a excitement anymore it's more so just like, oh, I'm excited to just see my friends and worship together. Whereas last time when I went, because I'd never seen him before, it was like, oh, wow, like, you know, I love his ministry. Everything he's doing. I'm so like, let's go. Now I'm still like, let's go. But it's more so just like, I'm just, I'm just happy to be there. Do you know what I mean? Um, so yeah, I know it's going to be amazing by God's grace. So yeah, I'm just going to pray for Journey Mercies and head out. Bye, yeah. <laughs> I'm shy. Anyways, um, yeah, I'm really honored to be here on Hallelujah. the FR yeah. channel. Amen. What can I say? Like, this girl has been on her. <laughs> No, keep going, keep going, keep going, keep going. Keep going. You're, about so You're about to flow. You're about to flow. She said, Lemondo Scott to the ah, Hallelujah. Wow, he's in the room. Hey. Amen. Hey, oh, sorry. Oh. Hey, guys, it's me again. This is our good sis. Where are we going? We're going to see what it looks So excited. Listen. Okay. What should you do? Good night. Keep we, today. Every day. Nous avons. Oh, today. <laughs> Nous avons. Um, Nous avons avec euh um, oui. avec euh euh mon père mon père nous avons un concert, concert oh. de yeah. William Dale I'm just saying good, but avec, I think avec um mi famille good oh I feel honored <laughs>
leading worship and stuff. Because I don't have to be in a public place. I haven't released music in five years. The longest time I've ever gone. But the thing is, I don't do anything until I have a burden from the Lord. Then when I get the burden, I wait for language. Then when I get language to the burden, I wait for melody. And then when he gives me melody to the language of the burden, then it's time to release music. So outside of our church, until tonight, I need y'all to be quiet for a second down on the floor. Now can you hear you sing? You are God's sing. Time is currently 1 a.m. BST time, Greenwich Meridian. Um, but it was very good. Like, just felt God's atmosphere really intense. Mm. Um, and the instrumentalist was amazing. Amazing. I met the bassist and Ron Brown. If you don't know Ron Brown, this is Ron Brown. <laughs> if you don't know Frank Bidet, this is Frank Bidet. The red drummer was the. Ah, uh, damn. Tired. Sorry. But yeah, you go again, I don't know when. Mm. Uh, any takeaways? Guys, give your life to Christ, man. Seriously? That's all I can say. Huh? That's all I can say. Seriously? That's all I can say. Amen. Spiritual bind. Hallelujah. Thank you. Hi there, so I'm currently in my bathroom. Um, I'm currently working on Operation Locks. So let me try to show you. So these are the locks before dipping. Um, and then these are the locks after dipping. So as you can see, there's a difference for sure. I'm gonna flip my camera to you so you guys can see properly. Um, but yeah, I'm dipping them, it's Saturday today and obviously I'm doing my hair Monday. So you guys will see that in next week's vlog. Um, yeah man i'm excited because i feel like i prefer the look of the dipped ones rather than the undip they're a bit more squiggly um but yeah that's all like that. hi guys oh you're this violating as well right. <laughs> so i'm at my auntie's house it was her birthday on friday so we just got together just to have a bit of munch you know he's making me a drink and he thinks i'm mocking him like that's good. No, because guys, I was wondering why is he adding the move? He's, why is he adding the ice after? But apparently, you get more juice that way. Juice. But do you want to explain what's on my plate right now? There's chapati. Chapati. Chicken. Chicken. Meat. Meat. Beef. To be precise. Beef. A bit of oxy. Tell. No, that's not oxy. Tell else. Potato. Irish potato. Jonna. Potato. Yeah, what's the rice? What's the rice? Some pilau. Pilau. Pileu. Mm, no. Pileu. Thank rice. you so much. And the cranberry juice. This is the cranberry juice. Is there anything you want to order? The apple. Thank you for the phone. Thank you for the window. Thank you for the door. Good night, good night, good night. Um, guys, Jonas' phone's broken. <laughs> no, it's it was. Can you fire, can you fire in the? Jonas, uh, you look you? finished. Okay, fire. just say bye to the vlog for us, please. <laughs> you you got to get the fire in the vlog. Fire, fire in the fire in the boo.
Oh. Hey guys, how are you? Yeah, good, buddy. I'm for today. Wow. Now, daily music. Right. So excited. Wow. Um, I don't know if Gideon's in a position to talk right now. He just wants to eat his food. <laughs> <laughs> Safe, buddy. We went to get um, milkshakes from Five Guys. Five Guys. We already ate. Yeah, we're not really hungry anymore. You know? Guys, it makes sense. It I was sleeping on Oreo Bisco. I was just Bisco. It's good. Oreo Bisco makes sense. Mm -hmm. Try it. Try it. Yeah. It's yeah. crazy though. We're in the mix. Yeah. Scary. Yeah. Get down, Ganana. Yeah. 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 Yeah.